Hi Sagittarius, this is gonna be your March 2020 uh, first 20. <laughs> I lost my thought. I lost my thoughts there for a second. Give me a sec. Let's see what's going on with my Sagittarius. Remember, if this doesn't resonate with you right away, that means you can come back to it later and see what's really up. And grab you a couple cards. And King of Pentacles is the first thing that's coming up. It was jumping out. I got this card right in my hand. You were feeling very stable about your life decisions recently. You're feeling like you finally found the one for you. I'm seeing that. That is actually the focus of your life right now is work and this love that you have. Judgment in the middle. You're still waiting on someone to make a decision about something. And it, it seems that your advice here is to get real spiritual about your next couple of steps because you're feeling like something you've always wished for is happening. Wheel of Fortune. Wow. You see how that... I don't know if you saw that, but how that flipped out right there. That Wheel of Fortune, how that flipped out. That was the craziest. Wow. All right, let's see here. Yeah, I'm also seeing Six of Cups, Justice Reverse. You felt like someone lied to you and was keeping you stuck in a situation um, and it was draining your energy. Right now you're feeling forgiving and full of love and I'm seeing that you're feeling like everything is about to change for you right now. I'm seeing that you may or may, or may not have had some setbacks in your work life. So maybe something felt made you feel like there was a waste of an investment. Maybe something had you doubting yourself a little bit. But I'm seeing that that's kind of over now. Let me see that. Clarify the Eight of Pentacles reverse. What was my Sagittarius throwing their hands up for? You were waiting on some kind of clarity concerning yourself, concerning your life, or concerning your work life. Maybe some kind of decision is put off, or maybe you're stuck about work. Maybe you can't get to work right now, and that's making you really angry because you're very money-minded right now. I'm getting the energy that you're very money-minded right now, but... Something has had you pissed off. And it's not because of yourself. Like, you want to go to work, but you can't go to work for some reason. I'm seeing something that you want to take your energy to work, but you can't. It's like you're forced to stay at home for some reason. Clarify the Four Swords and the Queen of Swords. What is these two? What are these two trying to tell me? The Devil Rest. Okay. You, you might be thinking about a Capricorn, or I am seeing the energy that... You're trying your best to do the right thing, and you know that work would help you do that. But now I'm seeing that, like, man, you're just, like, getting, like, all these, like, you're, like, really bored. You're really bored not being able to work. Something about you, you not being able to go to work is making you feel very bored and dull with your life. And you're feeling like, man, the devil's gonna burst out of you if you don't get busy really quick. Like, you're feeling, like, like so jaded with your moment. And you know that if you just had the opportunity that you would really make things happen, Queen of Wands. Okay. This is looking like a really nice energy, really positive time in your life right now, Sagittarius. It's looking like this March is very, very abundant for you. Because you have the right ideas, it's just things things are just kind of acting weird. Yeah, Ace of Wands, wow. You're having the nice, right ideas, but yeah, there was in your recent past, again, I'm seeing a lot of fights. Maybe you cut someone off who wasn't being fair to you. I'm seeing that you cut someone off who's draining your mental energy strength reverse again. All right, let's make a Celtic cross and then get some clarifiers on that. Okay. If it doesn't fit, don't make it fit right. Just gotta, you gotta know that. If it doesn't fit, don't make it fit. Let me go around again for my Sagittarius. First 20. There First 20. What do I see for my Sagittarius? Swords out of your head. Eight of swords reverse. Eight of pentacles crossing that. Yeah, you wish you could get to work. You're already out of your head, but you could wish you could get your ass to work also, but you can't, right? You finally got out of your, the mental, uh, the mental demons, the, the demons you told yourself, and you feel like there's a change there. In your recent past, there were two options. And you're still kind of blocked about those two options, I'm seeing. You know that the old cycle is over for sure. Your main focus is maintaining the happiness that you come you come across finally after so long. You come out across this newfound happiness. You're coming into being with the sun. 
that is what you're feeling like um ten of swords the old cycles over you're having this new found ferocity about life you're trying to be a taker like you're ready to go go out and seize your opportunities the knight of wands there i'm also seeing uh maybe you kind of beating yourself up a lot about expectations you used to have and it's not in a healthy way i'm seeing that you may be overindulging on certain behaviors that you know are not serving your best uh interest at heart but it seems that um maybe i'm getting like the uh, I'm getting some kind of vibe that it could be some turmoil about some gossip you heard. What people are saying about you is that you're taking a wrong turn about something. Maybe people are judging your decision. There's a lot of, I'm seeing a lot of venom come your way with the Six of Swords reverse. That could be a sign that um, things look like they may be about to get worse. But it seems like, uh, pardon me, it seems like uh, here I'm saying, it seems like I'm getting the energy you're doing it to yourself. I'm seeing some kind of overindulgence, but it's because you were riding the wave of some kind of pride. I'm seeing that you were very happy about something and your focus is on how to be happy. It's not like you're trying to be toxic to yourself. It's just, there's something that uh, must be missing from the equation that has you feeling uh, blocked. I think it's just the fact that you can't get to work and that's making you miserable. I think that must be what the thing is because I think you you probably dry, derive a lot of passion from your work and it feeds into you because you're closed off to messages you're not taking anyone's bullshit the tower knight of pentacles reverse but you're just feeling very bored and you're just maybe drinking maybe that's what you're doing I find the nine nine of cups reverse three pentacles reverse okay you feel like uh something is closed off to you now some kind of balance and fair decision was closed off to you and you're going into yourself about it but you don't really see any clarity yet about it. And you're blocked by some kind of fears. Fool reverse. Clarify the Knight of Wands. What does my Sagittarius want to go cl closer towards you? You just want to go closer to abundance and stability. The Emperor. You want to keep yourself protected from anyone's dangerous and evil. A Aries energy. Clarify the Six of Swords reverse. Why do the people think that my Sagittarius is in a less good space? High Priestess reverse. Maybe someone caught you in a lie. Maybe someone caught you being dishonest about something, about some messages, and about how good you are. I'm seeing that someone's called you maybe impatient or maybe made some kind of claim that, oh, you don't need anyone, maybe you're single, and maybe someone's feeling unsettled about that. Clarify the High Priestess reverse. Why is my Sagittarius... What's happening with my Sagittarius? What kind of secrets are out? Maybe the secret about an Aquarius, the star. Ace of Cups, maybe some new love on your mind. But it's someone you're not waiting for. Hmm. Clarify the Two of Wands. Your advice is to consider your decisions that you have to make carefully. Think about what nourishes your spirit. The Tower, I'm seeing there was a fight that now led to a decision that's not been made. And it could be that... You're really considering what you want to invest in, what you want to grow in your life about a decision you've already made about someone who is your soulmate, the Empress with the Lover's Reverse. Okay, and the Four of Swords Reverse at the end of your reading and the likely outcome is that you're going to come out of this shell or this self, uh, this self retreat of, uh, of a spiritual nature. You're trying to nourish your spirit by being alone and the outcome will be in you rejecting some kind of small offer, you standing in your power, there will be a decision made about everything and it's going to be a positive one. Getting that energy from the cards with the Knight of Pentacles reverse, the Seven of Wands upright and the Judgment. You're going to be staying in your power and deciding that. What's the last card to see here? And the answer is not in socializing. Three, three of Cups reverse. The answer is not in socializing. So whatever you're doing while you're by yourself, that must be the answer, even though it feels a little uncomfortable now. Let me see another two cards what my Sagittarius may need to hear right now. Ten of Pentacles reverse. Don't vest your stability in another. And Six of Wands upright. Great, great, successful days of much fanfare are coming ahead. And it could be in letting go of your fears with the chariot. All right. Bye, Sagittarius. Take care. Love you. Take care.